Botalo Falava. My name is uh, Faunga Molinga. I am uh, the vice president right now on the school board here in San Francisco. And then I'm also a member of the uh, San Francisco Democratic County Central Committee. Um, I was uh, born in Hawaii, uh, raised in San Francisco, Hunters Point Project. And um, I think for me, one of the proudest moments is, um, you know, most Samoans are faith-based. You know, we believe in God, we have a spiritual following. And, um, you know, I think um, it's, it's really interesting because for me, the proudest moment is when I was actually at my lowest moment, right? And um, <clears throat> yeah, I say that in terms of like, you know, I was, you know, homeless, living on the streets, you know, just kind of going around. And I think the two things that kept me together was my faith and the fact that I knew I was Samoan, right? Like, I'm Samoan. And I grew up in the islands too. You know, I was like, I know what to do. Like, my grandfather, my aunties, my mom, like, we are people of the ocean, you know? So that spirit, you know, just kind of like helped me rise above like all the um, challenges I was going through at that time. I was like, if anything, I was like, just, you know, you're someone, you're someone, you know, you have the someone spirit, you know, loco kele, loco kele. And that just kept me going. And now, you know, a decade later, you know, master's degree, I got a pretty good job and, you know, taking care of my kids, you know, and so, but a lot of that was really just understanding and knowing who I was. Loco Kele means like, um, have a big heart, you know, like, it's like courage, you know, Loco Kele means like, you know, um, I know it's difficult, but like, you know, you're going to be okay. And like, you know, have a big heart, you know, and um, we, we really strive off of that in the Samoan community, you know, with, um, they call us the heart people, right? The heart of the ocean. And uh, we do things with passion and love, you know, and so, but that's the, the saying of uh, local Kele, you know, like have a big heart, you know, you can do this. It's encouragement. Sure. I'm Matt Haney. Uh, I'm the District 6 Supervisor representing South Market, Civic Center, Tenderloin, Mission Bay, Rincon Hill, and Treasure Island. Well, I think this is a really important uh, API Heritage Month because this has been a really tough year. And there have been so many people from the API uh, community uh, who have been on the front lines of responding to this pandemic and this crisis, um, whether they're nurses, whether they're on, out there on our streets as social workers, as doctors, uh, uh, you know, driving, delivery, working grocery stores. Uh, and everywhere you look, you see API members of our community making incredible contributions to our city. And for people who live in San Francisco, we know that this is the norm. This has been a part of who San Francisco is since the very beginning. Uh, Asian residents of this city contributing, building, serving. Uh, and I think that we've seen that, we know that, and we value it. But this is a year especially where we really have to uplift it with gratitude because we needed folks more than ever this past year. And it was a tough year. Uh, people didn't get to see their family members. People put their own health at risk. And everywhere uh, where that was happening, there were API residents uh, on the front lines of that. And so I wanna say thank you for the contributions that you make every day to this city, uh, to serving your neighbors, to supporting your neighbors, to building the culture uh, and contributing in so many ways to our city, but especially this year where we really needed folks more than ever and API residents at every single level, everywhere you look, uh, stepped up.